Well, you're back here with Barry, and I'm enjoying one of my favorite cigars from Malduino, and just working my way back through another river, a little bit more rockier of an area. Got to take it easy here, put it in uh, four wheel at least, and uh, hope you guys have enjoyed or are enjoying this adventure. A little bit more of a crawl area here. But nothing uh, that I don't mind doing on my own, because I'm not worried about getting stuck in this. But anyway, uh, this has been a great day for me. I really enjoyed it. Had a fine lunch. I stopped out in uh, right by Boba River. Now I'm crossing one of the finger channels, and I'm going to end up somewhere near Los Cajuiles, which means the town of the Cashews quite a ways from there yet but uh, we're working on it and like I say I'll be home around uh, oh dark should make it home by about sunset once I pull over and got to air back up my tires for highway use <clears throat> and uh, been a great day I'll tell you I've enjoyed every minute of it and hope you guys have too and it's kind of a great way to spend a Sunday. And I don't know why more people don't enjoy these outings. But we do have some of the good folks that uh, are coming down here uh, on a full or part-time basis. There's been one or two families uh, that have expressly expressed a strong interest in enjoying some of these wonderful trails as they're going to get themselves a vehicle that's capable of uh, getting out to these places and that'll be wonderful for me uh, I do have a couple of friends that like doing this but unfortunately they're located in the capital so it's not all that often I get out there to see them unfortunately like I say but uh, uh, just give me a second to bounce around this rock pile here and this isn't much of a road but um, we'll definitely make the best of getting up this thing. So I would love to see more people enjoy the adventure and get on the outback like this. Like I say, Dominican Republic has some fine four-wheel driving. And I just for the life of me don't understand why people... Uh, in greater numbers don't enjoy the wilderness just even for the day I mean I'm not saying you gotta camp out here like like I'll be doing or something like that but just for the day it's just uh, a great way to spend the day and I wish more people enjoyed it that way they're missing some of the finest parts of this country and they're missing meeting some of the friendliest people you could ever imagine and uh, who knows, you know, like I say, I never say never. Never is not a long time. It's timeless. And uh, maybe more will start joining us because we'd love to uh, share a big part of the country with them and get them out to all different areas from, uh, oh, heck, even venturing out into Haiti is great. Uh, we have some friends out there, and we're well looked after, so we don't have to worry too, too much about the negative aspects of Haiti. But... Like I say, uh, who knows, maybe in the future.